Hi friends, Mrs. Type is back reading the last couple chapters of Mercy Watson, Princess in Disguise. And get your hot butter toast ready. Yummy. Chapter 13. Well, said Stella, I guess the parade is over. Nothing is over, Eugenia Lincoln shouted. She stared up into the branches of the tree. General Washington, said Eugenia, come down here immediately. Mao, said General Washington. General Washington, said Eugenia, I will not take no for an answer. Mao, said General Washington. Cats don't really usually use, do what you ask them to do, said Stella. Nonsense, said Eugenia. General Washington always obeys orders. I think that cat is stuck, said Frank. Nonsense, said Eugenia. General Washington is far too intelligent to get stuck. Eugenia called General Washington again. And again, but General Washington would not move. I think, said Mr. Watson, it might be a good time to call the fire department. Chapter 14. At the fire station, the phone rang. Ned took the call. How's that, said Ned. General Washington, said Ned. Suck up a tree, said Ned. Right, said Ned. We're on our way. That was a strange call, Ned said to Lorenzo. Apparently, a general was stuck in a tree. Hmm, said Lorenzo. What is the address? Somewhere on Decawu Drive, said Ned. Decawu Drive, said Lorenzo. That's where the pig lives. Oh boy, said Ned. We'd better hurry. Chapter 15. When Ned and Lorenzo got to Decawu Drive, they saw a large oak tree. Underneath the oak tree was a pig in a pink dress with a tiara on her head. It is just as I su suspected, said Lorenzo. There's that pig. Yes, said Ned, but where is General Washington? Thank goodness you are here, said Baby Lincoln. What took you so long, said Eugenia Lincoln. Is that General Washington, said Ned? He pointed to the gray cat high in the oak tree. Of course it is, said Eugenia Lincoln. Meow, said General Washington. Lorenzo got a ladder from the truck. He leaned the ladder against the tree. He climbed up the ladder. He reached out and grabbed hold of General Washington. To the rescue. He climbed down the ladder. He put General Washington into Eugenia's arms. Hooray, everyone cheered. You can always count on the fire department, said Mr. Watson. That is what I say. Oh, said Mrs. Watson, we should celebrate. We should have a party. Mercy pricked up her ears. Parties, in Mercy's experience, almost always involved toast. And last chapter, chapter 16. Everyone was in the Watson's kitchen. Everyone was gathered around the Watson's table. Have you ever had the... The toast here? Lorenzo asked Stella. No, said Stella. You're in for a treat, said Ned. The toast here is excellent. Eating food at a stranger's house is potentially dangerous, said Frank. But we are not strangers, said Mrs. Watson. We are your neighbors. Meow, said General Washington. Bah, said Eugenia Lincoln. Who needs neighbors? Oh, sister, said Baby. Here, have a butter barrel. There's the butter barrel. Mm. My darling, my dear, my porcelain princess, said Mr. Watson. Aren't you glad you put on that pink dress? Mercy put her stomach up in the air. She sniffed. Bread was toasting. Butter was melting. The pink dress was terribly snug, but it was worth it. Oink, said Mercy. Happy Halloween, my darling, said Mr. Watson. Happy Halloween, everyone. That is a big stack of buttered toast. And that is the end. So Monday for Zoom, we are going to draw Mercy together. There she is. I'll teach you how to draw her. Maybe we can put a tiara on her also. 
So make sure you have paper, a black marker, a pencil, and crayons. Need all that to draw her. All right, friends, I am glad that we shared this book together. And next week, I'll start a new one. I'll figure out what is a, a good one. I'll probably have to go back to the classroom and get one that I have. And we'll do some other fun stuff. Mercy Watson art projects, math. I have more art projects lined up. Meanwhile, have a great weekend. Enjoy your hot butter toast. And I will see you soon. And I am working on Zoom so I can work it properly and we have good reception. Well, I do. Learning it. It's all a big thing to learn. But it's always great to see your faces, so I will get it. All right, think positive. Stay safe. Have fun with your family and brothers and sisters. And I will see you soon. Okay, bye-bye.